Before long, a standard news report visual language established itself, one that's immediately recognisable to anyone. Me has this report. It's it starts here with a lacklustre establishing shot of a significant These location. Bags are over. And here's why. Huge numbers of bags end up littering our towns and countryside every year. Next, a walkie-talkie preamble from the auteur, pacing steadily towards the lens, punctuating every other sentence with a hand gesture and ignoring all the pricks milling around him like he's gliding through the fucking matrix, before coming to a halt and posing a question. What comes next? Dramatically. Often and something like this, a filler shot designed to give your eyes something to look at while my voice babbles on about facts. Sometimes it'll slow down to a halt. After which the report is padded out with a selection of lazy and pointless vox pops. Um, usually get some inane chatter from people. I think they do have too much. I think what we want to hear is actually what's happening and not what other people think. Well, I've got different opinions on it, to be honest, because I feel... All right, you can feel your five piece your bags, but no day bags. <laughs> you just have to look around the uh, parts of the city and you'll see the mess. Uh, plastic bags everywhere and uh, uh, too many people just throw stuff away. I, I hate these sound, sound bites. <laughs> that, that, I, I don't want some punter's opinion usually. No. I think it's just ridiculous. They shouldn't be doing that. Uh, at shopping, they need a bag. Another bit of dull visual abstraction to plug another gap now, but so to wake you up, this is an animated chart, this is a silhouette representing the average family, and this is a lighthouse keeper being beheaded by a laser beam. And the carrier bag charge applies to all single-use carrier bags, whatever they're made from. That means you'll have to pay for bags made from plastic, paper, and other recyclable materials. You'll be charged for all bags, regardless of use. It's not just food shopping, but also clothes, electrical products, and all other goods. But what about those exemptions? Well, you won't have to pay for bags provided for hygiene reasons, such as bakery items, loose fruits, or vegetables, sharp goods like unpackaged knives or razor blades, items which could be contaminated with soil, or medicine. From a pharmacy. As we near the end of the report, illustrative shots of pedestrians and signs and a pipe at a window. And then the final summary, ending on a whimsical shot of something nearby, accompanied by a wry sign-off. If you're lucky, a bit of wordplay fit for a king, or in other words, a regent's treat. Charlie Brooker, Newswipe, London.